Katie Price has been slammed by stunned fans for promoting products on social media just hours after she broke down in tears on live TV over her dying mum. Earlier in the day the devastated former glamour model walked off loose women after speaking about her mum, who has the same incurable disease as the late Keith Chegwin. The TV presenter died on Monday aged 60 after a battle with a progressive lung condition of iopathic, pulmonary fibrosis. Appearing on Loose Women to talk about the condition, Katie said, How can my mum die? I love my mum, so much, before leaving the studio. Later that evening Katie took to social media to thank her fans, but the post soon riled some of her followers. Why? Because the mum of five also used it as an opportunity to endorse a range of products. Alongside a picture of her holding her phone with a personalised case to her ear while sat in front of a personalised bag and cup, Katie wrote, Today's been a difficult day but thanks for everyone's support. While plenty of her followers continued to offer their support to the star underneath the post, some were less impressed. Wow have you no shame? Is there nothing you wouldn't do for a freebie, one fumed? Another shocked, fan said. Always difficult when people pass away but got to make sure you get your sponsored tweets, in that at the same time eh? Wow! Just unbelievable! Embarrassing! Said a third. A fourth wrote, a perfect message. Of how, sympathy can turn to apathy in seconds. Another called her classless, while someone else said, It's been AST day my mum is dying but let me promote my products that I got for free. Another pointed out that the tweet would have been perfect if it wasn't for the product endorsement. Would have been a nice tweet if you didn't finish by hawking your merchandise. During her appearance on Loose Women on Tuesday morning Katie had that, while fighting his own health, battle, Keith Chegwin had got in contact and given her mum Amy advice about her illness. Speaking about her mum, she said, she won't see Harvey's 18th birthday, all the kids. How can my mum, die? I love her so much. I can't do this. Katie was taken backstage by caring Ruth Langsford and did not return after the break as the show continued, with just three presenters. Denise Van Outen had to explain that Katie was dreading speaking about Keith's death and had her personal struggle backstage. She burst into tears just seconds into speaking about the TV star's tragic death and struggled to get her words out. Katie said, Keith got in touch and we've been speaking to him lots and he was speaking to my mum. The thing is my mum is going to die and I just don't want her to die. The former glamour model started to well up again but bravely continued to speak about her mum. She said, my mum had a cough for about five years. They thought it was asthma. A few months ago she had a cold. Then she went privately to see. How can my mum die? Right in the run up to Christmas. She's so healthy. 
Katie's mum Amy was told she had between three and five years left to live after being diagnosed with terminal lung condition idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis. Amy was given the heartbreaking news following an X-ray after initially going to hospital for asthma and a little cough. Keith who was on portable oxygen in the last two months, had been in touch with Katie Price after her mum Amy was diagnosed with the same terminal lung condition that killed him. On hearing about the star's death after a long-term battle with a progressive lung condition, Katie took two to share her grief. I'm absolutely gutted that Keith has passed away, she wrote about her Celebrity Big Brother co-star, from the 2015 series. I only spoke to him a few weeks ago and he was giving my mum advice as she is suffering with the same lung condition my mum has which is IPF an incurable disease. She added, he was such a very down-to-earth and extremely funny and absolutely loved his wife Maria and children so much. I will miss him and so gutted as we were all trying to fit in a date to meet up. I'm just in shock how quick this has all happened since I spoke to him. R.I.P. Keith and will continue with your advice from my mum. Appearing with Katie on Loose Women earlier this year, Amy said that she wanted her daughter to be settled, before she pegs it. Keith was suffering from idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis which causes fibrosis or scarring of the lungs, making the organ stiffer and breathing more difficult. As was the case for Keith. The condition worsened over time, and there was no cure. Smoking is thought to be a contributing cause, along with pollution, acid reflux, certain viruses and genetics. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.